they need to notify us. I mean, this is scary that I didn't know about this and the video is out. Parental concerns in light of pure chaos. All of this erupting in the halls of South Fort Myers High School. Students throwing punches and knocking each other on the floor, all in front of teachers. And now it's raising a lot of concerns among parents about school safety. Four in your corners, Lisa Greenberg, taking their concerns straight to the school district and getting answers about how it plans to keep such mayhem from happening again. Lisa? Amy, as you're about to see, this was not just a little fight between a couple kids. This was total mayhem. The Lee County School District says eight South Fort Myers high school students were involved in the brawl. And what happened in the halls has both parents and students worried about their safety. It looks like a scene from a movie. Students being pushed against lockers, punched to the floor. But for the students of South Fort Myers High, this was a recent reality. One person hits the other and then, you know, friends see it and uh, they just want to get in. I asked Jacob Williams about the fight. Um, there has been a few fights. So I showed him the video. Yeah, that's a real fight. It is. Yeah. And you saw it? Did you see it? Um, I walked past and I was like, no, I'm getting out of here. And other students don't blame him. I just walk on past, you know, I just ignore it and uh, just do my own thing. I went down to the Lee County School District office for answers on what they're doing about this. I didn't get an interview, but I did get a statement. The district says discipline of students involved is in progress and will proceed as outlined in the code of conduct. It also adds that the procedures they use to keep students safe were effective. Adults were in the hallways monitoring students and were able to defuse the situation quickly. And students tell me school officials are quick to stop the brawls. Most of the fights that will happen, which there hasn't been many at all, they are stopped, you know, as soon as possible by security. I showed parent Jennifer Sioma the video of the fight. Oh my gosh. This was the first she'd heard of it and she's not happy with the school district. They need to notify us. I mean, this is scary that I didn't know about this and the video is out. Now she's worried about her daughter, Catherine. Knowing that my daughter's safety might be in, in jeopardy. So, I mean, it is scary. And district officials say there are more than 2,000 students at South Fort Myers High School, and this incident is not reflective of their entire student body. They urge parents like Jennifer Sioma to contact them about any questions or concerns they have about the situation. Live in the studio, Lisa Greenberg, Fox 4 in your corner. All right, thank you, Lisa. You've seen the video, so now we want to know what are your thoughts, and what do you think about the school district's response about this matter? You can voice your view when you call us at 206-FOX-4 or email us anytime at news at fox4now.com. Dot com.